friends. Today we're going to use our lesson from last week and add some amazing effects or filters to it. You can make one or you can make many. The website is really useful though, so I do recommend you bookmark it so you can upload other photos to it and add filters to them as well. Okay, let's go. Open your browser and go to www.lunapic.com. It's kind of like lunatic, but instead of a T, there's a P. I was a little overwhelmed at first with this website, but remember, you're in art. See that Vincent Van Gogh painting of Starry Night way at the bottom? Click that and it will open the library of filters that you can experiment with. Click on one of the filters and at the top you should see a browse button. Click that and find your holes in layers lesson from last week. You can experiment with other filters on this bar or you can click on the extended library right here. There are so many possibilities. Towards the bottom, there are famous artist filters. Here is the Starry Night filter. I do believe this website just keeps adding filters on top of filters on top of filters. So if you start to lose your photo a little bit, you can click the home button at the bottom and you can re-upload your picture again to start over. You can also play around with this menu and use other effects like I did with this kaleidoscope filter. It's centered in the middle, but if you click somewhere else on the canvas, it will center there. And then you can add more filters. I wanted to experiment with uploading different versions of my Holes and Layers project to see which one I liked best. I like seeing the extended library, so I go back to the home button and click the Starry Night painting again. When you find one you want to save, just click the Save button. When you're finished, upload one or more of your filtered images to Artsonia in the gallery called Filtered Holes and Layers. Go to Artsonia Class Mode, type in our school code ZJ. W C S R R X. Click your grade, start typing your name, and then click on it when you see it come up. Choose our lesson. Click the blue select image button and find your photo. Mine was on the desktop, but yours might be in a folder called downloads. Then click the green button that says upload now. Green save button, enter a title, enter an artist statement if you choose to, and then when you're finished, you can log out. Remember, lunapic.com to add artistic filters to any photo. Maybe you can try taking a selfie, adding filters, and then uploading it to Artsonia in the Art Free Time folder. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. See you next week. Bye!